In a peaceful village, there lived a renowned spiritual teacher named Master Li. Master Li was known for his deep understanding of the nature of truth and his ability to guide seekers toward direct experience. He often used metaphors to convey profound teachings, one of which was the metaphor of the finger pointing at the moon. One day, a curious student named Mei approached Master Li, seeking clarity on the metaphor and its significance. Mei expressed their confusion about the relationship between teachings, rituals, and practices, and the ultimate truth they aimed to point to. Master Li smiled warmly and gestured to the night sky, where the full moon shone brightly. He said, Look at the moon. Its beauty and radiance are undeniable. Yet if I were to point at the moon with my finger, would you mistake my finger for the moon itself? Mei contemplated Master Li's words and replied, No, I would not mistake your finger for the moon. I understand that your finger is merely pointing toward the moon, guiding my attention to it. Master Li nodded in agreement and continued, Indeed, teachings, rituals, and practices are like the finger. They serve as pointers guiding us toward the truth, the direct experience of reality. However, just as you wouldn't mistake my finger for the moon, it is essential not to mistake the teachings for the truth itself. Master Li emphasized that the focus should always be on directly experiencing the truth, rather than getting caught up in the teachings. The teachings were meant to inspire and guide, to awaken the seeker's own direct experience of reality. They were not the truth in and of themselves. Days turned into weeks as Mei contemplated Master Li's teachings. With each passing moment, Mei began to understand the profound wisdom in the metaphor. They realized that it was their own direct experience, beyond words and concepts, that would lead them to the truth they sought. Mei shared their realization with Master Li, expressing gratitude for his guidance. Master Li smiled and encouraged Mei to continue their journey with an open heart and a willingness to directly experience the truth for themselves. News of Mei's profound insights spread throughout the village and beyond. People sought out Master Li's teachings, eager to explore the depths of their own direct experience. They recognized that the finger pointing at the moon was not to be grasped, but to be used as a guide, inspiring them to seek truth within themselves. The village became a sanctuary of self-inquiry and direct experience. People let go of attachment to teachings and rituals, embracing them as valuable tools on the path, but always with the understanding that the truth was beyond them. They focused their energy on directly experiencing the boundless reality that lay within and around them. May the story of Master Li and Mei inspire us to embrace the metaphor of the finger pointing at the moon. Let us honor and appreciate the teachings, rituals, and practices that guide us, but never mistake them for the truth itself. By focusing on our own direct experience, we can transcend concepts and awaken to the profound beauty of reality. I hope this story captures the essence of the metaphor and its significance. If you have any specific changes or additional ideas in mind, please let me know. Thank you once again for being a part of this incredible experience. Your views, likes, comments, and subscriptions have made a significant impact on this channel, and I am truly grateful for each and every one of you. Remember to click subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notification bell so you won't miss out on any future updates.